Today at noon, we have live team coverage of a community coming out to remember an officer who died in the line of duty. They're honoring the memory of 37-year-old Robert Bingaman. The Asheville police officer died when his car plunged off the Jeff Bowen Bridge last week. We start our coverage with News 13's Cheryl Barber, live near the Veterans Cemetery in Buncombe County. Cheryl, he'll be buried with full military honors. And that part of this tribute to this officer, Anna Marine, is just coming uh, to, uh, just starting right now at the cemetery. This morning, hundreds of law enforcement officers, firefighters, and rescue workers joined Officer Bingaman's families and friends at the Biltmore Baptist Church. The family asked that our cameras remain outside. Police Chief William Anderson praised the dedication all law enforcement officers to the community and for the six-year service Rob Bingaman gave Asheville and the APD. Now, Chief Anderson said every day, officers go into the community to serve, protect, and rarely offer themselves in the ultimate sacrifice. He said anyone who knew Officer Bingaman would tell you he had never had a crossword for anyone. On Tuesday last week, he was doing his job protecting people from speeding traffic. Officer Bingaman told his family he loved what he did and he loved his radar unit. Troopers are still investigating what happened that caused him to plunge from the Bowen Bridge and to die in a fatal accident. Now at this hour, the funeral procession has wound its way from Biltmore Baptist to the cemetery here at the Veterans Cemetery. The Marine Corps will provide military honors for his service to the country from 1996 to the year 2000. I'm Cheryl Barber reporting live at the Veterans Cemetery in Black Mountain. Now to our live team coverage of the community remembering an officer. Services honoring Asheville Police Officer Robert Bingaman took place today in Buncombe County. Officer Bingaman died on duty when he had an accident on the Captain Jeff Bowen Bridge last week. News 13 Cheryl Barber attended the funeral at Biltmore Baptist Church this morning. Now he's live at the Western North Carolina State Veterans Cemetery in Black Mountain. Cheryl, that is where Officer Bingaman is receiving full military honors. Victoria, that's going on right now as the funeral procession has arrived and the Marine Corps is preparing their ceremony. The family now is seated beneath the funeral tent and a caisson will deliver the officer's remains. This morning, hundreds of law enforcement officers, firefighters and rescue workers joined Officer Bingaman's family and friends at the Biltmore Baptist Church. The family asked that our cameras remain outside. Police Chief William Anderson praised the dedication all law enforcement officers offer to the community and for the six year service Rob Bingaman gave Asheville and the APD. Chief Anderson said every day, Officers go into the community to serve, protect, and rarely offer themselves in the ultimate sacrifice. He said anyone who knew Officer Bingaman would tell you he never had a crossword for anyone. On Tuesday last week, he was doing his job protecting people from speeding traffic. Chief Anderson quoted the Bible saying, no greater love has a man that he would give his life for a friend. Now, troopers are still investigating what happened that caused him to plunge from the Bowen Bridge and to die in a fatal accident. As you can hear at this hour, the funeral procession has, uh, is complete uh, from Biltmore Baptist to the cemetery here. The Marine Corps will provide those full military honors for his service to the country from 1996 to 2000. And that is what is uh, happening here at the moment at the Veterans State Cemetery in Black Mountain. I'm Cheryl Barber. Now back to you.